Hi everyone, my name is Tiffany, aka All Collect Games, and I am back with another Star Stable update video. So this is going to be a three-part video because there are new horses, new horse breed. Obviously, this is going to be the first part. The second part is going to be the new holiday quest, and the third part will be the new holiday powders for your horse. It's going to be super exciting, but we are focusing on the new breed, the Connemara, which I believe is considered a pony in real life. Um, but they are treating it as a real horse, like a regular horse, standard horse in this game, if I'm not mistaken. Let me go ahead and read what the update page says. It says, the curious Connemaras are here. The friendly and curious Connemaras, Connemaras have arrived in Jorvik. Originally from Ireland, this versatile breed is used for show jumping, dressage, and eventing. While the Connemaras is classified as a pony in most parts of the world, it's fast enough to be allowed to compete with the other horse breeds in Jorvik. Now the time has finally come for the curious Connemara to go explore, exploring the Jorvian plains and forests together with you. So... Where can I buy this horse? You'll find one of them in Fort Pinta and two of them here on Paddock Island. They are 810 star coins each. And what level do you need to be? That's a good question. <laughs> For four weeks starting today, you can buy the Connemara in Fort Pinta no matter what level you're on. But in four weeks, you'll need to reach level 12 to buy any of them. But the ones on Paddock Island, you have to be level 12 to get. Uh, you don't need to work on your reputation to get these, and these come in three colors. Dapple Gray, Buckskin, and Bay Roan. Um, th is there anything else I need to know? The Connemara is actually a pony. It's fast enough to race against the bigger horse breeds in Jorvik. This means it can't compete in the pony races or the pony championship. And then let's read just a little bit here. I think it's all the same stuff, but we're going to read it anyway. It says, The Connemara is best known today as a sports pony. Ridden by both children and adults, it is considered to be a very versatile pony breed. Competitive in show jumping, dressage, and eventing, but also with the stamina for endurance riding. While the Connemara is classified as a pony in most parts of the world, it is a fast enough breed to be allowed to compete with the other horses in Jorvik. So we have level 1, strength 4, discipline 2, swiftness 0, endurance 0, agility 1. Um, and, of course, it's 810 star coins and you have to be level 12. So this is the first color we have. It's a little crowded here, so I'm a little worried about getting good angles here. It's very crowded, actually. Actually, it's less crowded than when I first got here. But this is the side view of this particular one. I like it a lot, but it's not my favorite. Um, I love the color of his face. I just am not a fan of the rest of his body, but I love him. Don't get me wrong. Do not get me wrong. And he has, I believe he has brown eyes. I'm trying to, yeah, it looks like brown eyes. Oh, maybe. He's just really pretty. I love his face. I love the coloring on his face. I mean, I love the coloring all over, but I just feel like the face is just amazing. And look at his little nose. Okay, let's go over to the other one. It's a little less crowded over here. This is probably my favorite one, I believe. Um, I'm trying to look at the pictures here. I want to make sure this is... No, this is my second favorite one. Um, but this is a really, really good one as well. He also has... He has brown eyes. I love his main color. I like how it kind of ombre is there. I'm sorry, you guys. I can't really see because these people... There's so many, so many people here today. But I love the little pattern on his body there. And then he has, of course, he has little um, boots, socks, you know, whatever you want to call those. And let's go on this side because it might be able to be, a, yeah, it's a better view over here. We have, I'm trying to get his face, but, you know. Uh, <laughs> but he is so cute. There we go. There's a little bit of his face. Sorry, this is um, this a little bit in the way. But... I love, love it. It's so cute. I like the little bit on his nose. I'm sorry, you guys. <laughs> Let's see if we can click on it. Okay, there. Um, can he look up for me? Can you look up for me, buddy? There we go. Look at that little bit on his nose. He's so, so, so cute. Oh, what a cutie. What a cutie. What a cutie. Uh, I can't decide which one I want to get. It's either this one or the one in Fort Pinta. But since I'm here, I gotta think... That maybe, maybe. Oh, does he have a little marking on his head too? I can't tell. You can only tell like when he shakes it. Yeah, he does. A little like star. <gasps> oh, what a cutie. Oh, he's so adorable. I love their animations. I love it. Now I can't decide which one I want. <laughs> I do have a lot of black and white horses. So maybe I should get this brown one, perhaps. So adorable. 
Anyway, we should probably head to Fort Pinta and check out the last one. Here we are at Fort Pinta, you guys. It is very crowded, so I had to click on the horse to actually see him. Uh, there are a lot of people surrounding it right now, so this is the best look I'm getting. The best glimpse, the best angle. I'm sorry about my rabbit as well. She's doing some bun destruction in the background. But he looks so cute, I just wish he'd look at me. I wish he'd look at me. I mean, there we go. <laughs> All right, I love when they shake their little heads. Oh, oh, we lost a lot of people. It looks like there's only this two people left. But here we go, this is the look. Oh my gosh, he has cute little brown eyes. He has the same little hair, just flipping around, flopping around. I'm so sorry about Lucy, oh my goodness. She chooses, every, every, I, I promise you, she only does this when I film. <laughs> so this is the pattern on this one. I think it looks so good really really good I like the boots the socks whatever we want to call them on this one as well this is so good I really like it I just you know I have a lot of black and white horses so I might like a lot of black white and gray horses so I might go with the brown one but this one is definitely a contender I really really like this one <laughs> so cute and again I'm sorry you guys who can't really get good good looks at these guys because it is super super crowded here <laughs> um, well it's not super not too crowded today but this is an option. I really, really like these. These are such beautiful horses. Ultimately, I decided I think I'm going to choose this one to purchase today. So let's go ahead. Can I not click on you? There we go, little friend. We're going to go ahead and buy this adorable one. And, oh, I do like that name, Sienna. But I'm going to go through here and definitely pick a name. Got to pick him a good one. We have chosen the name Crazy Chaser because I feel like he's going to be a little crazy friend and he's just going to dominate everything because, you know, he's a little pony. Well, he is considered a little pony, but he can compete with the big dogs. You know what I mean? So this is super awesome. Let's go ahead and confirm. We will go back to the stable and grab Crazy Chaser and we will check him out. Here we are, you guys, at the stables. Let's go ahead and hop on Crazy Chaser here. And let's go take him outside. Let's see. I will put on some gear. I have some from... I think I have my club gear on hand here. Hold on. Let me see. Let's go into my backpack. Yeah, there we go. That'll do for now. Crazy Chaser. Oh, goodness. Let's check him out. Let's take him over here. Let's check them out. Oh my goodness. Whoa, look at this. I like the animations. It looks so good. Okay, let's start from walking. So here's walking. And then let's go to the next. Ooh, he looks really good. And then moving up. And up. Ooh, I'm really liking these animations. And then let's go up a step. And then again to, we're running, we're running, we're running. Look at that. Look at that. Looking so good. Oh, there is a wall. <laughs> there is a wall. Wow, he looks really good. And let's watch him kind of just standing still. Um, I like always seeing those animations. Uh, let's see. I like his little hair just flipping around. That's so cute. Did he just fall asleep? Oh, I thought he fell asleep there for a moment. He's just chilling. Let's see if I get off of him. Oh, wait, hold on. Let's see. He might do something else. Let me get off of him. He looks really cute. Oh my gosh. What a cutie. I like his little, like, nostrils are moving. I never really noticed that with other horses. I don't know if that's, like, a new thing. But he's so cute. I'm trying to see if he does anything interesting. <laughs> I love his little nostrils. He's so cute. Alright, let's take him out around... Oops, let's take him around riding again. Here we go, let's go. He's a speedy little friend. Whee! Jumping. Whoa, I almost ran into that. And 
Nice, nice, nice. I really like it. Okay. Now I should probably watch where I'm going. Okay. Let me know which of the new Connemara colors you like the best. Obviously, you know which one I chose ultimately, but I do love them. They're all super, super cute. But let me know in the comments down below what you think of this breed, what you, what's your favorite color. Let me know all that fun stuff in the comments below. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.